Hello guys. Yes, it has been 10 years. Um, it doesn't feel like it. Um, it doesn't, yeah, I can't believe it. Um, I think that might be more because I stopped uploading a lot for the last two and a half years and that might have more to do with it. Um, I don't think, I mean, you can't really call me a YouTuber anyways. Even when I was uploading daily, those god awful daily commentaries, I just wanted to talk and I was like, why, why was I, why was I making these? Yeah, you can't even really call me a YouTuber. Who, who knows? Who, who really cares? Um, but yeah, so, uh, yeah, man, it's, it's crazy. I, I forgot about it for most of the year. Um, I think it was, Markiplier in like May or June, he like streamed his 10 year anniversary. And I'm like, oh sweet man, nice, congrats. And I was like, oh no. Um, so I clicked on my channel, I'm like, oh fuck. Um, it's my 10 year anniversary too and I've done nothing to prep. So I was like, well, I better get on top of that. And then, um, yeah, summer happened and then fun stuff. And then I got distracted and then I think it was Dan TDM and the Game Grumps, who also had 10 year anniversaries, I'm like, oh shit, I forgot. I, I should work on this. And then, you know, the rest of summer happened and then eventually it was August. And I was like, oh man, I, I, I really hope I'm not too late. And in true fashion for me, sticking on brand, it, yeah, it was too late. And um, <laughs> oh man, I, I did not prep. I mean, I tried. Well, not really. Uh, yeah, I just messed up. <laughs> so that's, that's typical for me, right? So um, yeah, th for those of you in the know, you guys saw the thumbnail. You guys know exactly what's happening here. So hopefully you're already getting on top of that. Um, but for the people that are new here, um, yeah. So when you do see one of these videos with the blank thumbnail, um, typically the description's pretty short. Um, there's no tags on the video. I don't want it getting traction. I don't want this getting promoted. That's kind of the thing around here. You know, it's not about, it's about not sticking out. Um, and for this reason, it's mostly because I want the people that I, I talk to in the comment section pretty often, or, you know, the people that actually stop by more often than most, or, you know, stick around, you know, for my lousy content. I want them to get rewarded for it. And I obviously want to give them back more because, you know, they, they give more to me. They, they spend their valuable time, which you could not give back on watching my content. So obviously I want to, I want them to get it, but it's a first come first serve at the end of the day. That's the most fair. So, um, if you haven't seen one of these videos before and it's your first time here, um, this is a giveaway. This is, um, part of my, I guess the, two things I want this channel to be, no, I guess three things I want this channel to be remem remembered for, which I will get into later. But um, yeah, this is a giveaway, plain and simple, black and white, exactly what a giveaway should be. There's no rules. It's not like, oh, hey, if you want to do this, you got to subscribe to my channel and make sure to leave a comment, blah, 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 and follow me here and <laughs> all that bullshit. No, none of that. So all you got to do is just ask for a gift card code. Um, I will need an email address. Um, I, it used to be back in the day, we had something called a YouTube private messaging feature, but that got removed in um, 2018, I think. I think I did a giveaway in COD World War II, either just before or just after it got removed. And I was like, either... No, I would have been pissed. I would have been like, uh, like completely oblivious beforehand. But I think I, I think I might have been afterward because I think I was pissed, saying like, "What the fuck? Like, how am I supposed to contact these people? I don't use social media except for YouTube, which is still true. I don't use Twitter, TikTok, um, the gram. I don't, I don't use any of that. So really, it's just YouTube. So that's like my main way of contacting and talking to you guys. So um, I will need an email address. Um, do not make it your main email address, but you will have to comment an email address down below. Um, there are sites where you can get like these auto-generated ones or ones where anyone can use them. And you know, people use that obviously to get email addresses from, you know, I guess places they don't trust, which are plenty on the internet. So they use it for that, or you know, they use it when you have to have an email address, you have to put in one, but obviously they don't want to use theirs. Um, there's a legit workaround where you can actually use Google Chrome. Yes, I know Google, but you can use Google Chrome. You can go into settings, you can sign in from there, and you can actually create an account and you don't have to use a phone number to verify it. Um, I've tried this for years. I started doing this back in 2016 or 2017, back when, um, What's it called? Uh, my first return back to Modern Warfare 3. So back then I was doing it. I just did it, you know, a week ago and it still works perfectly fine. So I, I know for sure it works. So if you if you need an email address that you just need to use and throw away, then do it. But obviously don't spam it. If you use the same IP address or the same device, um, there is a limit. It goes anywhere from like three to four or five but it will eventually stop you from making one without using a phone number. So don't spam it. You know, all you need is one because you're just asking for um, a gift card code for me. So yeah, just um, put your email address down below and say, I want a gift card code and I'll send it to you. Um, I was trying to 
you know, the 10, 10, I was trying to have 10, $10 Amazon gift card codes. Um, these are only us codes. They don't work outside the States. So sorry if you're watching from broad. Um, I had the issue before in a past uh, giveaway where I think, um, I think his name is Robska. He did make some of the art for this. I think I'm actually using his logo and the art still. So if you're watching this Robska, I think that's your name. Hopefully I didn't, I remember it right from I think 2017, back when I made a BO2 commentary saying thank you for the art and stuff like that. So man, it's been a while, but uh, yeah. So if you're listening to this, I uh, hope you're doing well, man. Um, he was in Croatia. So his when I gave him a code, it didn't work for him, but thankfully he had a friend in the USA, so it worked. He could just send it to them. So uh, that was the workaround, but yeah. So if you're not in the States, I'm sorry, you, these don't work for you. But yeah, so if you want a code, just put it down below with email address and say, I want a gift card code. That's it. I will send it to you. Um, I, I wanted to have 10, you know, you only have one 10 year anniversary. So I wanted to have 10 of 10, but in true fashion, like me back in the beginning, like I said, I, I fucked it all up. So um, I use feature points and you know, feature points is great. You know, you don't need an ID verification. You don't need a phone number verification. It's fantastic. The best one I've ever had. There is an issue though, and that's with delays. And um, yeah, uh, <laughs> that is an issue. So um, there are certain limitations when you can, um, you know, get get your rewards, and uh, when you can, you know, make more claims for more rewards, and you know, getting actually credited for stuff. You know, there is a bit of a delay, but you know, that's the that's the uh, you know that's the uh, the one con. You know, that's what you have to give up for not having to verify yourself, which I instantly you know, really appreciate it. You know, if there's any sites out there that you use, you know, offer sites that ask you for a phone ID, or sorry, uh, uh, what's photo ID, phone ID, photo ID or phone verification, do not give it to them. Or if you're gonna do the phone one, um, then use like Google Voice or get one of those, um, they're like those trial SIM cards or whatever from like, I think, no, not track phone, is it, um, uh, what was it? Not, not Cricket, is it Mint Mobile? Like you can actually just use one of those and if they do really need one, just get one of those and give them like the, the free trial number or whatever so you don't have to give them yours. Never give out your phone number, guys. Don't ever do that. So um, similarly to this email address thing, you know, give me a throwaway email address. You know, don't give me your real one. But yeah, so feature points is great for the fact you don't need to verify yourself. However, the trade-off is that there are major delays sometimes, especially like when you're supposed to get rewarded a lot. And uh, for reference, like 6,000 points is $10. So I'm actually waiting to get the stuff I, I completed. Like I was waiting, like waiting to get these because I wanted to have 10. So unfortunately right now I only have seven and a half. Um, obviously I'm not going to give the eighth person a $5 one to say, Hey, there you go. But um, I have like a, some $10 ones and a lot of $5 ones. Obviously I'm going to pair up the $5 ones together and send you two codes. But yeah, so um, I'm supposed to get 10 and a half. That, that's still not 10. Uh, I, I didn't major in math. So <laughs> seven and a half now. Hope to have 10 and a half. Neither of those add up to 10. So, um, yeah. Uh, so, um, worst case scenario, if I don't get the, you know, credited and I, you know, can't get the $10 codes in a, you know, a reasonably quick, like, speedy manner, I'm going to just, I think on my Amazon account, I can actually use my own gift card balance to request $10 Amazon gift card codes. I'll get those sent to me and I'll just reimburse myself with the codes when they eventually get to me. So, um, yeah, I, I will just handle it however way it needs to be done for you guys to get your codes. So um, yeah, there will be, let's just say 10. Let's, there's gonna be 10 codes, so it's first come, first serve. If you ask for one, I'm gonna give it to you and then I'm gonna put an update in the comment section below saying I'm all out when I'm all out. But um, there hasn't been, I haven't like given all of them out like quickly. I think the last time I actually gave them all out like in under an hour was the COD World War II giveaway I did, um, I think during the summer back in 2018. and. That was like, I was, I was surprised. Like they, I think it was gone in like 40 minutes. It, it was crazy, but it hasn't been that way since. So I think it's okay. I think I'll have time, but in case I don't have time, I have alternatives to, to make it so it works out anyways. But yeah, enough about the giveaway. So yeah, request your gift card code down below and I'll give it to you as quickly as possible in an email. But um, yeah, 10 years, that's, um, that's crazy, man. It's like, how much YouTube has changed. Like there's people I watched back in the day and I guess, I guess you could call them my, uh, uh, my counterparts, I guess. Not really. Cause it looked like they wanted to do it. Like make it more than a hobby. This has only ever been a hobby for me. It's never been more than that. But, um, you know, raging Amish no longer makes videos. Um, I haven't checked on psychedelic snake in forever. Um, 
Xbox Ahoy, I think is still around, but like uh, Chris J. Spooner stopped making videos years ago. It's like, oh my God, like everyone that I watched and everyone I thought of like, hey, you know, you were like, you know, we made, we started our channel similarly and we both like YouTube. We're kind of that older connection back to what YouTube was before and they're all pretty much gone. And that's, that's kind of sad, but you know, as long as there's at least one corner of YouTube where things are you know, we stick to those old morals where it's like, you know, don't do it for the money. Don't do it for fucking sponsorships. The, God, I hate seeing those at the uh, like three minute mark. You're like, oh, by the way, um, this video is sponsored by or this hurts like, uh, what's it called? Today's sponsor is blah, blah, blah. It's like, oh my fucking God. If I have to see another Masterworks or Boxu or um, Raid Shadow Legends or War Thunder. If I had to see another World or World of Tanks, if I see another one of those fucking sponsorships, my God, it's like ad blockers don't work anymore because I mean you could skip, but it's just it's just annoying seeing that. And you know, I being reduced to being a shill, and especially like you know, or oh God, what was the other one? It's like you could own a title to a land which you don't actually own. We just made up this paperwork. I forgot what that, that sponsor was. It's like, you can buy a title to land which you don't actually own, but you could be a lord in name, but not really. It's like all this like shady stuff. It's like, what the fuck is this? It's like, oh, I never wanted to do that. That's why this has only ever been a hobby and it will only ever be a hobby. Um, none of my stuff is monetized. None of my stuff ever will be monetized. Um, I did join an MCN, but mostly for like, oh, what what can join it? Like everyone's talking about, you know, these... Um, um, what are they called? Multi-channel networks. I joined the Freedom Network. It's like, oh, it can be part of a community. Like, what can it do for me? And it's like, oh, I guess I, I get paid for it. I never actually withdrew the money from my PayPal. I think there's like 20 bucks in there. I, I don't remember. I, I forgot the login for that email address anyways that I, had, that I sent the, the money to the PayPal for. Uh, you know, my ads or whatever the hell. I don't remember what it was. Like, what was I getting paid for? I can't remember. But um, I, I just, I, I don't, I don't even, I didn't even get the money. So it's like, it was just pointless. And then eventually... Um, I didn't meet the requirements. I forgot what it was. You have to get like a daily, monthly, um, is it like minutes watched? And I obviously didn't meet that because I was just doing it for fun. So I got booted. So it's like, well, whatever. It's like, I'll just carry on. So, I mean, yeah, God, that was, and that alone, I just described it. That was like a two and a half year, three year run. And oh my God, wow. It's just the more, the more I think about it, the more it's crazy how fast time went by. But um, yeah, back, going back to the whole thing, like this will only ever be a hobby. I will never do a shitty sponsorship like, ah, oh, here's a sponsorship and you're gonna give me the money I paid, like the money that you were gonna pay me is equivalent to a fee I paid for a sell order on Coinbase. Like, nice, it's like, thanks for the pocket change. It's like, why would I sell part of my soul to do that? Like, for instance, like, you know, if you guys are watching ads, I, I don't monetize the channel, so please use an ad blocker. You know, whether it's like the Brave browser or you bought like an, or you not bought, you added, downloaded an extension to your browser to block ads, please do it. Cause you know, it's like, you're already using up your valuable time to watch my content. You know, don't spend any more watching an ad for a channel, which I don't even monetize. It's like, well, it's not, you're not doing me any favors. You're just using up your valuable free time. So please, for your sakes, do not watch ads and block all of them. You know, I, I don't give a fuck. I just do this for fun but um i guess moving forward it's like i don't want to reminisce too much about the where we've come from like the past because it just makes me sad it's like man all the people i watch and all the people i talked with are all are all gone like my youtube friends for the most part except like edwin joe um i don't really talk to wacky cast anymore but like for a little while i talked to him um, and everyone else is gone, and it's like, there's only two of them left. Oh no, Rager Gamer's still around, so Rager Gamer, there's three. So out of the three people I talked to, like, years ago, or like, I think it was 12, or like, maybe it was 15, or like, it was up there, but like, only three of them, four including me, are left, like, making content. Like, that's, that's just so sad, so I don't want to talk about that. So moving forward, guys, um, the three things I kind of want my channel to be known for, like, at the end of the day, what it should be known for is, you know, one, first off, like I said, Back to old YouTube where it wasn't about money, it wasn't about fucking sponsorships, it wasn't about monetization, all that garbage, you know, it's just, you do it for fun because you want to have fun. If you can make money from it, you know, go right ahead, you know, before YouTube was seen as like, wow, I can make this my job. It's like, it was more like just, wow, I can earn money from this. You know, back then it was very innocent, it wasn't about, you know, monetizing your audience, your brand, yourself, you know, sponsorships and ads everywhere and, you know, deals and whatnot and it was just very innocent, so, at the end of the day, that's what I want this channel to be a little bit reminiscent of. It's like, you know, I'm just here for fun, just here to you know, do what I enjoy, here to talk to you guys in the comment section like it used to be, like people actually responded to, you know, obviously when you get too big, you can't. That's why I don't want this channel to be known, like 
known out there. Like I want it to be very small. Like that's why for this video, I didn't want it to get traction. I didn't, I didn't put any tags. I didn't put any big descriptions, no flashy titles or thumbnails. I don't want it to gain traction. I want you guys to get it. The guys that watch my content, you know, my small little corner of the internet, I want you to get it. Some people that I actually talk to in the comment section, like TCOS, or um, sometimes I see um, Omega come by, or um, Chem, you know, you guys. I want you guys to get it, because I talk to you guys, and you guys actually see, keep coming back. So I obviously want to thank you guys in the way I know how to, which is <laughs> this very inefficient means of getting gift card codes, which, you know, it, put yourself in my shoes where, like, I want to pay you guys back for spending your time, but, you know, anyone can just go out and buy it. But, you know, when I earn these cards, I do surveys, I play apps, you know, I spend hours trying to earn them. And to me, it's like, you know, first off, it's something to do while like, you know, I look at charts or, you know, I'm just watching, you know, someone do a breakdown of a new like company that might be IPOing. But it's like, you know, when I'm doing that, like I do, I do these apps and, you know, I'm spending hours earning it, which, you know, to me is like paying you guys back for spending hours watching my content. I spent hours earning you guys gift card codes as a thank you. So to me, it's like the effort shows more than the card itself, if that makes any sense. Hopefully it does, or I could just be wasting more time than I need to. Maybe I'm just doing that, who knows? It would be on brand for me, because I am an idiot. But, um, so yeah, that's number one. So number one, I just want it to be like reminiscent of old YouTube. Two, I just want to make it a place where like, if you need content or you need gameplay, because obviously some of these games, you know, like especially Call of Duty, like the old ones become like hacker nests and, you know, just infested with people cheating. If you need gameplay for a commentary, you're more than welcome to use my content. Like, I'm not gonna bitch and moan. I'm not gonna say like, oh, yo, whoa, you're using my stuff. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna flag you or whatever that. What do the people do when when they like, oh, copyright? I don't, I don't even know what they do. But um, I won't like bitch and moan about it. Like, it's like, yeah, go ahead. Just you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna probably make a video for it. It's gonna be like the new, um, what, what's it called? Like a header video or like when you click on someone's channel, like it plays that video first. I'm gonna make a video about it, but it's gonna be like, you can use my content, but in all caps, dot, dot, dot. It's like, I'm gonna have some rules. Cause you know, like I said, I don't want this channel to become big. Cause I, I like talking to you guys in the comment section. I like the keeping it small and you know, being able to actually talk to people and not get flooded or you know, get spammed or I don't do, you know, all that stuff I have to worry about when you get too big, I hate that. So. You know, just seeing, especially people that I've, you know, seen that get bigger and then they, you know, they stop interacting as much because it's just not doable for one person to talk to thousands of people or hundreds of comments. And, you know, I don't want to deal with that. I like, I like the more personal YouTube experience. So, you know, if I, if you are going to use my content and I'll use this guy as an example. So he, thankfully, you know, he used um, the spawn theme thing from Cold War. So, you know, that's fine. You know, if you want to use it, go ahead. You know, I, I didn't make this just so I could greedily hoard it. Like, if you like it, you know, I, I, I say, like, if you like, you know, the music, you know, from, like, when I upload it, just, just download it to your computer. Download it to your phone. You're more than welcome to. Um, this guy uploaded it. And um, thankfully, it didn't show my, um, I, what's it called, my PSN or, like, my name. So, thankfully, I don't have to worry about that. But, you know, if you're going to use my content, you know, first off, say you're not me. You know, so that way we get that across from the get-go. Two, say you, like, do not message or send friend requests to this person because I don't want to get, I'm a solo player now, you know, that's just the way things are now. I, I just, I don't want to get flooded with messages and friend requests, especially, like, if you think I'm someone else, it's just going to be annoying. And I, I might just block you if you're spamming me. So, you know, that's just a, you know, let's just completely skip that whole interaction. And then, you know, three, do not under any circumstances ever link my channel. Like, again, I want to keep this small. I'm going to keep it, you know, if I make myself, like, a, I don't know, a dispensary, like, yeah, take my content here, use everything, and I, but I say, like, you know, it's just, it's not gonna be great, and then, you know, if I, if I was kind of like that person, I said, you know, oh, yeah, you know, use my content, but remember to always link my channel, I'm gonna get all these people from who, I don't know from where, coming to my channel, and I don't know, they could be good, they could be terrible, I don't know, I don't want to have to deal with that, so it's like, I, I want to just deal with you guys, so, you know, that's why, those are the three things, you know, if you're gonna use my content, or my videos for a commentary, or use my gameplay, you know, just, Say it's not you first off. Um, say like definitely say do not send any firm requests or any messages to this account because you know it's not me. Obviously to this person who's using my content, you know it's not me. So don't don't send them anything. And then three under no circumstances mention my channel because I don't I don't want any of that attention. And then I guess the third thing is uh, these giveaway videos. I actually want to you know is it is it really that hard for people to do a giveaway? <laughs> it's like the more I see like yeah I got like. Or how about this, to do a good giveaway? Because I see like all these like, oh yeah, you can get, you know, a, a PlayStation 5 or, you know, get a copy of this new video game or get this one wondrous thing. It's like, 
you're, you have a million subscribers. Like you probably have an edit, you probably have editors. You probably have all this other stuff. You know, you're a big channel. Can't you divvy up? Like, can't you split that one PS5 into like, how much are PS5s nowadays? I, I stopped checking months ago. Um, but let's say it's like, I don't know, 550, $600. It's like, can't you just split that up into like 60, $10 PSN cards or like half can be Xbox cards and others can be, you know, PSN cards. Like, can't you just do that? You know, that you can have multiple winners or is that just too much work for you? You know, you're such a big guy and I know you have so many viewers and so many people will be asking you, but is it really too much trouble just to guarantee like you spread out the gift, you know, more more people get something instead of just one lucky person. He's like, can't you just spread the love a little bit? You know, is, is that too much to ask from a big, you know, content provider? So, and then all these people saying like, oh, if you want a gift card code, you gotta subscribe to my channel and don't forget to comment down below and like the video and follow me here. It's like, what is this bullshit? Like, you, it's giveaway is in the name. Like, it says give away. You, the point of the video is to give something away without expecting anything in return. How hard is that? So it's like I don't know. It's like it, it just. I think it's more to do with like the toxic nature of YouTube nowadays. It's like what's in it, what's in it for me? Like, how can I fool my audience into making sure I grow bigger and you know really promoting me? How and I get more money? How is it? How can I fool my audience who is already you know spending their time watching my content and maybe buying my products if I have product? Um, and I don't know, clicking on my links and doing all this stuff that I tell them to, what else can I do to like get more money out of them and monetize my audience? It's like, the fuck's wrong with you? So it's like, okay, okay I'm not gonna get more negative, but yeah, basically I want this to be what giveaways were in the past. Like again, this channel is just gonna be at the end of the day, just a very easy going, you know, it's back what YouTube was back in the day. Fuck monetization, you know, fuck ads, fuck all that stuff. I don't give a shit about that because obviously it's not my job. So it's a hobby, I'm gonna keep it that way. This is all for fun. We're all here to enjoy ourselves and you know, it's not about taking advantage of people. So, you know, just, yeah, that's a very angry way of ending the video. But yeah, so that's kind of what I want this channel to be at the end of the day. It's like, you know, a nice little corner of the internet where people that were around for old YouTube can maybe come back I mean, kind of reminisce on what things were like. And you know, again, it's not about ads. It's not about sponsorship deals. It's not, it's not about any of that. It's just uploading gameplay that I like and Hopefully you guys like too, and if you want to use the gameplay, then go ahead and use it. But you know, don't don't talk about it. This is gonna be like our lone little corner where you know only like the natural influx of people is gonna occur. It's not gonna be any like yeah, let's reach hands out and just drag people in. It's like no 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 no, we're not we're not doing that with promotions and you know getting the name out there. None of that none of that stuff. You know, it's just gonna be a very small little place, little corner of the internet where we can just talk, intermingle and you know share our thoughts and i you know I, I don't have to spend hours you know replying to comments you know as let's say for example if something gets really big and i got you know there's hundreds of comments like oh I'm, i want to reply to everyone but here it's you know it's just like 20 to 30 comments on like a really really good day and i can take my time replying to them and really thinking about my responses and you know it's fun i, I like it that way so let's keep it that way but anyways yeah guys thank you so much for watching the video now, really just me rambling but kind of you know i guess you know, reminiscing. I haven't really done that in a while because I haven't really been making commentaries. But yeah, just thinking about a little bit where I've come from and where I really want this channel to go forward. And you know, at the end of the day, when it all ends, what do I want it to be remembered for? And hopefully I kind of made that at least a little bit clearer. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching the video. Um, hopefully you got a gift card code. Hopefully uh, they didn't run out so quickly and then I'm really regretting this decision to move forward without being properly prepped or having more codes. But yeah, hope to have more codes in the future. I want to make this more of a common thing where like, you know, eventually it's like, oh yeah, like this is just like, people know exactly what to do. We have a lot of people in the know and you know, everyone knows exactly what to do. And who knows, like maybe this will be a thing where, you know, maybe I'll, I'll, I'll really encourage people to do giveaways for the sake of giveaways and you know, not trying to take advantage of their viewers. But who knows, maybe, maybe, maybe my uh, little corner of the internet will encourage other people to go back to honesty and you know, morality and having some personal integrity. But who knows, who knows, it's the internet. But anyways, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching the video. Hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay I showed in the background. Just uh, old gameplay, you know, really just showing where I've come from and how many years have gone by. Cause man, when I think about it, it's just crazy. It's been 10 years, but yep. Thank you guys so much for watching my videos. Really do appreciate it. Thank you so much for being here. Uh, and really looking forward to see, talking to you guys in the comment section and seeing what you guys have to say. So thank you guys again. Have an awesome day. I'll see you all in the next one.